A new paper in Science Advances has confirmed what ocean scientists have been warning about for years. The North Atlantic, the engine that drives the planet's climate circulation, is starting to break down. Researchers at the University of Exeter used centuries-old shells from deep-sea clams as natural data recorders. Inside those shells are growth layers that track changes in ocean conditions over time. The team found signs that the subpolar North Atlantic has entered a collapse phase not seen in more than 150 years. The shells tell a clear story. Two major breakdowns in ocean stability. One happened just before the 1920s, during a major climate shift. The other began around 1950, and the ocean has never fully recovered since. The data also show what scientists call critical slowing down. That's when a system starts to lose its ability to bounce back from disturbance. It takes longer to recover, feedbacks weaken, and the system's resilience fades. This signal often appears right before a tipping point, and now that signal is getting stronger. The study focuses on the subpolar gyre, the swirling current of cold, dense water that powers heat transfer across the Atlantic. That gyre is becoming unstable again matching conditions that led to past ocean reorganizations. In recent years, convection in the Labrador Sea, the deep mixing process that drives the gyre, has already stalled twice. If this pattern keeps going, the consequences could be sharp and far-reaching. Sudden changes in temperature, rainfall, and storm patterns across much of the Northern Hemisphere. The authors are blunt. The North Atlantic system appears to be moving toward a tipping point. There are no computer models or political interpretations behind that conclusion, only physical evidence drawn from the ocean itself. And when the North Atlantic circulation finally gives way, it won't fade slowly. It will shift all at once, fast, global, and irreversible.